Hi, it's my time to shine. I'm going to clear my space. The next reading will be for the sign of Virgo for December the 21st to December the 25th, 2020. I'm about to lay down. Don't feel 100%. Anyway, this is to clear my energy of negativity, gossip, bad vibes, evil, hate, jealousy, anything that's not of the divine, anything that's evil that's trying to come towards me near me through me i ask the divine to please bind it up and send it back to this rightful owner tenfold and the divine i always trust amen and i heard amen okay i'm going to be using my other deck and i'm going to be doing the virgo energy i'm taking one card for each day from december the 21st to december the 25th 2020 you as a tape will resonate and as I always tell you but I always need a rest this is not going to go for every Virgo but it's going to you know be for majority Hope everybody have a great holiday week. I know I am. I'm not going crazy. I'm relaxing. My body is tired. Honestly. Besides my read is when I want to. Universe, spirit guide. Let me read these readings accurately, officially, and quickly. And you all trust. Amen. Universe, spirit guides, okay. What is the energy? Okay. Surrounding the Virgos for December the 1st, excuse me, December the 21st to December the 25th for my Virgos. December, okay. Two more cards. The 21st to December the 25th. What's the energy that's surrounding? Okay, well, too much energy. I'm going to do that over because I only need two cards. What's the energy that's surrounding from December the 21st to December the 25th? What's the energy around them, please? What's the energy around them? December the 21st. Nope, one card, please, universe, because I'm not going over. One card, please. December the 21st to December the 25th. What's the energy around them? Mm, they're trying to give me all these cards. They want to talk, but not this reading. What energy around them from December on December the 25th? That's the only card I'm missing. Okay. Dang. They ain't want to really kick it like that. All right. The first card that come out is the Eight of Wands. The Eight of Wands is a um, fire energy. You could be dealing with a Leo, Sagittarius, or Aries. Something fast is coming towards you. Or you moving fast into another direction. You have the Nine of Wands, which this is somebody that could be incarcerated or in an institution. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. You have the Page of Wands reverse. Not making something happen. Maybe somebody, maybe somebody a little younger than you or younger than you that they not even trying to make a move to make something happen. December the 24th, you have the Six of Pentacles reverse. You're not giving enough. And a lot of them I do know they don't. You're not giving enough. You're not being balanced with the Six of Pentacles. This is um, Virgo energy. Capricorn and Taurus, you're not balancing out and giving enough for everybody. And that's December the 24th. You're not, you're not giving. Like, you're not giving to charity. You're not giving it to no organization. You're not helping others. That's what it's saying. And, like, I know they're not. Um, for December the 25th, you got the Queen of Wands. Queen of Wands be trying to make something happen. Maybe trying to make something happen on Christmas. Hot, whatever. Um, your week just look like you moving fast. It's like towards somebody or away from somebody maybe somebody that want to offer you a page 
but you're not sharing enough. You're not you're not balancing your finances with the with the world. And it's not with the world, but like everybody got to donate. Everybody got to give to charity or some type of something besides yourself and family. You're not doing it. And um you're going to feel a feeling of that. And that might be on December the 24th when you feel like things somebody ain't going to want to give to you. That's what it's that's that's what it's saying. So, I'm going to go straight to the angel um answers and see what they may want to say to you, but yeah. December the 24th, like you might feel it that you might need something, something, and somebody's going to just tell you they ain't have it, but you know they got it. And it might have something to do with uh, money, but you're not balancing out your finances or your, like, giving. Because this, this person, they giving to everybody. You see that? A big event? You have it reversed. You're not doing none of that. And that's like a part of being a part of this human world. And then on the 22nd, you may be hearing from somebody that's maybe incarcerated. Yep. So we're going to see what's going on. But it seemed like on the 25th for Queen of Wands, somebody's going to make something happen. This is Sagittarius, Aries, Leo energy. So somebody may make something happen or be in the Queen's, Queen of Wands energy. Or you may be in the energy to make something happen. I see a black cat here. So maybe you got a black cat. But you won't make something happen. I don't in some type of way. But somebody on Christmas, so we'll see if it ain't you, it's somebody else making something happen towards you. What is the energy for Virgos for December the 21st to December the 25th? Yep, that's what it says. And this is because of the divine. Ask for ask for help from others. Yeah. See, you might need help for something. But like I said, for December the 24th, you're not giving and giving or receiving. You receiving, but you're not giving back to the community or giving back to the divine in no type of way. So you may need help this week in something. And you may not get it. As you're gonna be like, damn, you may not get it. So I'm gonna just leave that alone. And let you figure it out. That's for my Virgos for December the 21st to December the 25th, 2020. Happy holidays to all.